today I am going to, oh, I'm scratching, I'm scratching. Heads up, I got like terrible, terrible hives and my entire body puffed up and my hands got like huge and my feet got giant. Anytime I scratch myself somewhere, like now that entire area will turn red and you'll just see like the scratch marks. Like I just scratched my knee a second ago and now it has like all these red marks on it just from like scratching it really quickly. So yeah, that kind of happens to me now. I really hope it goes away. Anyway, today I'm going to do an updated bikini collection. My bikini family has just grown a little bit bigger. I know I have an obsession with bikinis, I just can't help it. I live in Florida and basically I'm in a bikini a lot of the time. Anyways, let's just get started. Oh. So I'm not going in any particular order, I'm just going to grab what I see and show you guys. So, first of all, I'm showing you this very, very cheeky one. I said this in my last bikini collection, and I will say it again. Viewer discretion is advised. If you don't like little itty-bitty bikinis, then don't watch this, because I have plenty. This is from Victoria's Secret. It's just, like, the really, really cheeky um, bikini. You can, like, tan your entire booty and then not have, like, a two giant moons. So I went on a little bit of a Victoria's Secret bathing suit. Um... Rampage again because they had the semi-annual sale online and I just could not hold myself back But I got um, a bunch of new bathing suits So this is one of them the reason I love this so much is that it's cheeky, but it's not super cheeky It like just shows the right amount of booty But it's really really cute and it has like the cinching all the way down and then the top I got with this I usually don't wear with it, but um I thought I would get like a matching one just because it's push up so it goes like this and it kind of pushes them together which is nice um, and it's comfy. This bikini is from Mary Gray Swim and I love this especially because it's reversible. It is just covered in these like little um, diamond shaped prints so if I want to I can just wear the turquoise size. And then the top that comes with it is this one and I showed this in my like summer room remakeover video and it has these like um strings. The back's really cool too. It has this indent and I'm pretty sure this is reversible so you can just wear it like this. It does nothing for my boobs but then again I don't really have boobs that can be done much with. It just kind of like a little piece of paper. Okay the next bathing suit I have is from H&M and it just looks like this and it is kind of very like Hawaiian flower. It has this really cool like crisscross in the middle. This next bathing suit is from Victoria's Secret, and I'm pretty sure almost every teenage girl has this bathing suit. This is what it looks like. It is a push-up bathing suit. It has all these little frills along here, and they come in like a bunch of different patterns. And then I just bought matching bottoms, and I generally don't wear the matching top and bottom together. They're just string bikini bottoms. You can tie it up like in a little bow, but I kind of like to leave it with the strings down. So this next bikini is from Victoria's Secret. And the top is purple. I also have this in blue, but it got ruined in the wash with bleach. So I wanted to get another one. You have to be careful about the nipple situation with this one. I just recommend getting a bigger size for this. I got the bottoms again, like the cheeky ones, but not super cheeky. This next bathing suit is a bandeau, and I had to get a bandeau to replace my favorite bathing suit, which was... Um, if you watch in my last bikini collection, it was like purple and it had frills all around it and it was just a bandeau. Right, I don't know how to describe it, but it started to sag and it was just like these big like saggy pieces of cloth. I decided to get a new just plain bandeau and this has pads in it and it just has a little tie right here which is cute. And then the bottom is the double tie bottoms and it's just a regular bikini bottom. I've wanted this for like a year and a half maybe. It's just like a neon yellow right here and then a pretty turquoise color and I have a lot of bathing suits in this like seafoam green color. This next bathing suit I love so much I think it is so cute so basically it looks like this and the back of it is cheeky but again not too cheeky it's like the neon yellow crisscross sides and then it's like a pretty purpley pink color. Got it during the sale. Love it. I have not worn the top yet but this is what it looks like. It just has the, again, crisscross. It's just a string bikini and it is adorable. This next bikini I have, I didn't buy a um, top with it. It has like these little um, frilly balls on the top of it and it goes all the way around. I just think it's so, so cute and it's this pretty like pink peachy color. This bathing suit I love so much. It is scalloped all around and again, the seafoam green color. Yeah, it has this 
scallop detailing all along the bathing suit and on this bottom part too. And this does not have any push up, it just has like a wire on it. And I got the matching bottoms with it and these are also very, very cute. They have the cinching in the back and again they're just scalloped all the way around. This bathing suit is just a plain black bathing suit and I know it's nothing special. Um, it just looks like this and I just wanted like a plain black triangle top and just like bikini bottom. Okay, and then the last like brand new bathing suit I got um, was this frilly one from Victoria's Secret and it is so cute. Um, it's just a hot pink color and it's strapless and it has all these frills on it. I think a lot of people have these bottoms. It just has these like cinched sides and it's just a regular bathing suit bottom. So that is basically it for my new bathing suit. I have this one from Victoria's Secret and again I told you it got kind of messed up in the wash. It got bleached. So I want to just bleach the whole thing and then just make this a white bikini top because I think that would be really cute for like maybe 4th of July or something. So have these matching bottoms which are just from Victoria's Secret and they are just the plain string ones in this blue color. Then I have my DIY bow bikini. So I made this last year and I have a video on it on this channel so you can check that out. I will link it below if you want. But it's just bright pink and it is so, so cute. So I love this bathing suit. And I have this bathing suit from Issa de Mar. It looks like this. It just has this like crisscross on the top and it is so cute. And then the back also crosses. And then the bottoms I have with it are um, like this. They just have the like three strings on the sides and they are very, very cheeky but very cute. The next bathing suit I have is this fringe orange one and it is from Target. This next bathing suit I have is from Zoomies. It looks like this and it just has all these noddings um, at the top part and it's neon yellow and it is adorable. The bottoms I bought with it are from Billabong and they look like this and they're just tribal printed and they have like the cinching on the sides. This next bikini is from L Space and it is so cute. It is just um, like a turquoise blue color and it goes like this and it has all these little cutouts in it. It reminds me of an elephant because it's like the flappy elephant ears kind of. And then the bottoms are just these cheeky bottoms which um, used to be a lot brighter but they faded. <laughs> um, so they're just a bunch of different colors which is great because I can wear it with a lot of different tops. But yeah, it looks like this. It can be reversed and then worn with just like any bathing suit because it's black. So that's super nice. This next bathing suit is from Posh Pua. When you put it on, it kind of opens up and like shapes to it. And the top just looks like this. It's just like a triangle top with these cute little knots. This next bathing suit is from Victoria's Secret and I got it on sale um, a while ago. And it's just a black push-up top. And then these bottoms are from Victoria's Secret cheetah animal print bottoms and they're kind of silky looking. This next bathing suit is from Cotton On and in my last bikini collection I said that like I didn't wear this anymore but I started to wear it again because I'm finding it cute again. So it just looks like this and it has all these little frills and I also wore this in my waterproof makeup tutorial. The bottom of it just looks like this and it has the little frills on it. And then this last bathing suit I have is from San Lorenzo Bikinis and it's just kind of like a tie-dye blue and green um, stripy bikini. The top is just a plain triangle top with the same pattern. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this updated bikini collection. I know I've gotten a ton more and I just wanted to share them with you. But yeah, that is it. So I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will talk to you guys later. Bye!